Hi everyone, my name is David Kim. I'm a test engineer at W2BI and today I'd like to present to you our CTIA battery life measurement solution. First, let's quickly go over the setup. There's the LT emulator, client laptop, power analyzer, and of course the test device. The test device is connected to the LT emulator through an RF cable. And the dummy battery is connected directly to the power analyzer so that the power analyzer could provide power to the device as well as measure its instantaneous current and voltage. The three components, LT emulator, client laptop, and the power analyzer are all connected to the router through Ethernet cables so that our quick probe software could fully automate the test equipment configuration as well as operation. Our software, Quick Probe Global, has a very simple UI. On the left hand side we have a list of available test suites and once I click on it we see a list of available test cases. As you can see we cover every single test cases defined in the CTIA test plan including the battery drain test and the use case based current measurements. The main purpose of the battery drain test is to calculate the average voltage while draining a fully charged battery until the test device shuts off and this average voltage is used across all remaining test cases. This way we are able to base our test on the actual performance of the battery rather than theoretical values. The test procedure is pop-up driven so that the test engineer can just simply follow the procedure as specified on the prompt. One of which will be a detailed log. As you can see this is a log set of three iterations. And for each iteration we provide a table where um, all the key measurements are listed. To take the measurement analysis to the next level, we do provide a current consumption chart that allows user to zoom in and zoom out where each of these values will be updated as per user selection. Another log that we provide is an Excel spreadsheet that provides a, a general summary of the entire test cases that has been executed as well as per test case values. So why use our solution? Well, there are many benefits to automating your test environment, one being precise measurement. For battery life measurement, the logging duration is very important because it's different whether if you're collecting the log for 15 seconds or 15.5 seconds even. And if your solution is script driven, then every single iteration, this logging duration will be the same. Whereas if a person were to do it, then there is a room for error because depending on various reasons, one iteration you may be collecting the log for 15 seconds, whereas the next iteration you forget to press the button and then you end up collecting the log for 17 seconds. Now those two data are different, which leads to my second point, consistency of data. If you were to run the same test case over and over again, it's ideal that your, your results for voltage and current are, are near identical. The less the delta, the better it is. And ultimately, it just saves a lot of time because if you were to manually configure your LT emulator, for instance, to meet the CTIA requirement, it would take a lot of time because there are at least 30 or maybe 40 parameters that you have to manually configure for every single test case. Our script, however, is able to do it in a few minutes so there it is.